Hey everybody, I'm here today to do another unboxing video and I've decided to do a whole new series on my channel called Things I Buy Because of Facebook Ads. This is one of them. So today what we have in this box, well actually let's just find out what was, what's in the box. So let's open this up and I've actually been looking forward to this. I bought it several months ago and here we go. This is from Wandred and it's going to be the Veer 1811. It says 18, Veer 1811 packable backpack with inflatable back panel. I know that doesn't make any sense, but we're gonna go ahead and take it out of the container here and you can see what this is. So it's supposed to look like that right there. You know, it's just a little drawing there. But the idea of it is now I do like to travel and sometimes when I travel, I'll have like a big suitcase maybe that I'll check and then I've got another suitcase that it's my carry on. But then I get to my destination and then it's like, well, what bag am I gonna, you know, run around town with? Oh, great. Now, now we have, uh, oh, I was able to get it here. But let's see how this works and if it works as easily as the video said. So let's see here. This is the inflatable camera cube. We have a, oh, for goodness sake. Well, apparently, let's see, this is a part of the fun of an unboxing video. We're just gonna start taking this stuff out and see what happens. Well, and this is really lightweight. Oh, there we go. Oh, I guess it's all unfolding here. There we go. I, I knew that it would all kind of fold back into itself. Oh, wow, okay. So this is our little backpack here, but I know that a piece inside of this, or maybe it's inside of it, we'll find out if I unzip this. Oh, there we go. So there's like a piece of Velcro right here. If I undo that, there we go. This is what I was looking for. So this part right here is the back piece of it. Cause as you can see, this is just, I mean, it's just really kind of crushes down. It doesn't have a lot of stability to it, but if we open this up and then blow in it, <laughs> and I guess, I don't know, is there some trick to this? Heck if I know. Twist valve open and inflate and continue to blow while twisting valve closed. Okay. Uh, well, it's nice is it doesn't have a cap that you're gonna lose. <laughs> okay, no, it ended undone. All right, let's try this again. I don't know, maybe I'll take this stuff off of here. I do want to see what this looks like when it's all done. Okay. All right, there we go. All right, second time's a charm here. And this now this little back panel is all inflated and we're gonna stick this back into the backpack. It has this whole little pocket for it. I don't know which side goes which. I don't know, we're gonna guess and say that this is the bottom side and slide this in here. And that's, it's supposed to make it more comfortable. And then we've got this panel in here that I think just Velcros together. Something, there we go. And then this is the camera cube. So the whole idea is that if you wanted to go somewhere with your camera, that you could then put your camera in here and it would be safe and protected. So I'm gonna take this off. I don't know if this is all attached together or what the deal is, but. We'll find out. Oh, okay, so this one is separate piece. We'll put that off to the side. And then we've got the same type of valve that we had for the other. So I'll make sure that that's kind of mostly closed and then we'll inflate that. Okay. So this is our inflatable camera cube here. I see it's Velcroed right here. And I did grab a camera off to the side. So now I've got a camera and I'm just gonna drop that in. And then the idea is that it would keep my camera safe as I'm, you know, trekking around doing my thing. And then I think it's supposed to go in the top. So we're gonna go ahead and put our camera 
into our bag, just like that. And I'm going to zip it and I'm gonna close this. It also mentioned that it had a, a water bottle pocket on the side here. So let me grab a water bottle as well. So like I've got a big water bottle here and that will just slide right here into the side. And obviously I could put some other stuff in here, but I think the, the beauty of it, or maybe the camera is maybe supposed to go on top. I'm not really sure. So, oh, maybe that's the pouch. Anyway, the idea of it is now I've got this little bag that I can run around town with and go, go do my thing, but it also has some other features too. Oops, here we go. And I know that if you could, let's see, let's try the zippers on. The idea is you never have to take it off of your shoulder. So then now, even though it's still on my shoulder, I can unzip the side piece and then there's my camera right there. So easily accessible. And then we've got lots of little loops right here on the front. Let's make sure you can see that. So that's pretty good for, I like to carabiner stuff onto my backpacks. Um, that's like my keys. Oh, in fact, it has like a little key thing too. Well, that could clip onto other stuff. It's somewhere around here. I don't know. I mean, I've had it for, you've seen like three minutes. And then we've got the, a whole nother pocket here on the front. And this weighs, it's really, really lightweight. I didn't bring out my scale to weigh it, but I think this will be pretty slick. So now I'm going to see if I can take it apart and put it all back into its pouch and see what happens. But I mean, even though, yes, I buy it because it's something that I see on a Facebook ad. i am I'm actually pretty excited about using it and trying it out. I bought it, it was a quick Kickstarter project from Wandred. It's again, it's the Veer 18L. I know they make all kinds of bags and they've done other Kickstarter projects, but I think this will be pretty fun. I'm, I'm looking forward to using it. And yeah, what do you think? You know, uh, how do you think about an inflatable backpack and would that help with your travels? I'm not sure. So check it out. And uh, thank you so much for watching my video. And uh, I hope you have a great day and good luck to you as you look at Facebook ads and decide whether you're going to buy stuff. I hope you enjoy these segments. See you in another video.